So that's why I'm like, guys, tama na with this bowel thing. That's why I like my new post is, tuloy ba yung Pasko? Because, <laughs> <laughs> yes. I mean, holy yeah. yeah. So how would you remedy it then in regards to the EV, the influx of EVs? What okay. would you do? You got to talk about the, what are you trying to achieve, right? Mm -hmm. They're trying to achieve Clean Air Act, all right? Okay. Let's just say mm -hmm. that they're supporting the Clean Air Act. Okay, so admit that going to, maybe, I argue for other people to argue if it works or not, but let's just say because tailpipe emissions stuff, right. it does positively affect the Clean Air Act, but it doesn't do anything for traffic. It makes it worse, yeah. okay? So you have to weigh those out. Is that a fair exchange? Uh, that? Well, that's, that's that, the that thing. That, uh, is it a fair exchange? You need exchange? to have a public forum for that right. because some mm -hmm. people might say, look, I'm all for clean air, but not if I have, not if it takes me now, two hours extra to get to work right. because okay. now whatever those EVs save in pollution I'm in my car right Emitting. Right. So yeah. it, you see, everything has a cause and effect. Mm. Everything is related. And that's why it frustrates me when they just cherry pick this and cherry pick that and just say bowel this and bowel that. Because if you make bowel a U-turn, it doesn't mean that you're going to tell that person that they won't have to reverse direction. Yeah. It doesn't change that. They yeah. will still have to reverse direction. The only difference mm. is it might be five kilometers mm. down the road. Right. Now you add that five kilometers, that's 10 kilometers that they had to stay on the network for right. longer mm. unnecessarily. Right. Yes, it's a choke point here. You've just moved the choke point down there. <laughs> it's it. kicking the can, kick the can. Yeah. kicking the can down the road. So how I would do it is I would look at the policy and say, okay, what are we really trying to achieve here? Mm. And is the trade-off worth it? Mm. Back then there was really, well, I think it was already, they should have had the foresight to know Makati was going to be a financial district. Well, it was an airport. It was. Yeah. <laughs> but most countries plan with 50 years ahead. They right. act like, well, it was just an airport. Yes, it was 50 years, 100 right. years ago. Right. Not now. There had to be a plan when you built this. If you didn't, then you're also failing. Sure. Mm -hmm. Right? So you can't just say, well, we didn't know it was going to be. Well, what, your government, you're supposed to zone it. So you zoned it as a residential area. Mm. And I agree, it's unfair. It is very unfair because you're taking a huge track of prime, prime property in the most congested Correct. city on planet Earth and you're giving people 3,000 square meters for a family of four or six or whatever yeah, it is, sure, right? Sure. It doesn't make any sense. But on the same token, those people bought in good faith yeah. because it was sold to them as that and mm -hmm. they purchased it as a solution to their problem. Correct. Mm. You could keep going and going. You could say the same thing with public transportation because people say, remove the cars. It's the cars that are the problem. I agree. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's the most inefficient way to move people around, 100%. <laughs> mm -hmm. But this is a solution. This was born from a failure of government to provide a safe and and efficient option. Mm -hmm. Right. So that's all Public we're responding to. Mm -hmm. So now we open up, now we buy a car. Why? Because you don't trust to put your daughters, I'm sure, in a public track. Correct. There you go. Yeah. So you purchased your solution so that you don't have to do that. And if the government says, well, Rafi, now you got to end open up the doors to two more people that you don't know. Whoa. Yeah, well, because, you know, you got to sort of, it's, it becomes socialism. <laughs> yeah. I mean, at some point, you got to draw the line. Right. So I don't want this to be confused as a rich versus poor thing. It's it's nothing. It's no. private mm. property. Yeah. And it's precedent. Right. Because you will solve the traffic problem for a week or so, then what happens mm. later on? It's more traffic.